Well, in just over six months since it opened, the Christchurch Blood Bank has seen a steady stream of donors through its doors. But they stu still need more people. Chelsea Daniels explains. World Blood Donor Day is this Sunday and the Christchurch Blood Centre had an open day today. The team offered tours around the new centre, which opened in November last year and has seen steady donations ever since. The aim is to get them in here, have a look around our building in the hope that they feel inspired to become blood donors or to tell others to encourage other people to become blood donors. On average, blood and blood products are used by 135 Kiwis every single day. For many, it quite simply means the difference between life and death. Locally, we need 535 whole blood donors to come in here each and every week to donate blood. And plasma, we need 298 donors of them to come in so that we can meet the demand from the hospitals. We spoke to Shane Matson, who was halfway through the process of donating plasma. When well, I turned 16, I always wanted to donate. I just kept donating and it's just that goodwill feeling, I guess, and you know, doing some good. It doesn't cost anything, it only takes an hour of the time. People donating plasma like Shane will expect to be on the bed for up to one hour and 20 minutes. So we're taking the red blood, spinning it, returning the red blood and keeping the plasma, which is the yellow portion or the watery portion. Plasma is really important for us because we can make more products out of our plasma. It is a huge driver for us at the moment as well. So we can make up to 13 different products and they're either kept here in New Zealand or sent over to Australia to be processed and sent back. The new building has been a major help in the organisation and development of the centre. Certainly our location is a lot better now. We have really good visual signage here, which is a real bonus. But the big thing is that it's a purpose-built building and we have, it's large, we're two and a half times bigger than where we used to be, and so we can accommodate more people here. So yes, it's given us a wonderful opportunity to showcase our new building in the hope that people give it some thought and come and roll their sleeves up. New Zealand boasts the safest blood in the world, and there are rules to to ensure it retains its high standard. We do have rules about who can and can't donate blood. Those rules are set in place because our aim is to keep our product the safest it can possibly be because on the receiving end of the product is already a terribly sick patient. And what about those of us who are afraid of needles? Donating blood is a pain-free process. The actual needle in the arm to get out 470 mils only takes three to five minutes. It's not our aim to get people to come in and donate blood necessarily on World Blood Donor Day. It's our aim that we sow the seed so that they will contemplate it and hopefully come through, make an appointment. So that is our aim. Please think about donating blood. Call 0800 Give Blood to make an appointment or visit our website. It is a fantastic website and we have amazing stories, recipient stories on there which hopefully will help people make that decision. Chelsea Daniels, CTV News.